Okay everybody, I'm Harold with Nature's Friends and today I'm going to show you how to wrap a split bowl. The other week a friend of mine, not a friend of mine, now he is, called me from New Jersey, watched one of my videos and asked me what was wrong with his unit. And he sent me a picture and I spotted it right out at the butt. It was a wire nut on a piece of aluminum wire. Okay, and I told him what he needed to do. Okay, this is DI's. You always put it on the aluminum wire. You get a split bolt like this. You got a spacer in between it. It keeps the wires separated. You put your aluminum down in there, and you push that down, and you slide your copper right in. Okay? Then you tighten it down. Okay? See how you got a nice connection? Then you're going to tighten it with your adjustable wrenches. We use adjustable wrenches because that's what you always got in your toolkit. And we always have a habit of trying to tighten them three times. You let it set, then you come back. Loose connections build up heat. And heat with wire, what it does, is it expands and it just then it goes and gets loose and it, you got a problem. Okay, that was three times. That was one we did earlier. Now we got you always wrap it. I told the guy when you think you got enough tape on it, you wrap it some more. Same thing right here. You always wrap it. You always got to have at least the same amount of tape as you have insulation on a wire. So, you just always wrap. Scotch pad makes a pad. It's, it's, it's rubber that you just take and put right over it and squeeze it, then tape it. And you'll never have to ever get worried about it. But you never get into it. Plus, these little small ones aren't worthy of it. I've used them on big ones. And you notice I can talk and just keep on taping. Okay, we got it taped up real nice and good. You see there's two joints right there you never have to worry about. It. So until next time, I'm Harold with Nature's Friends, and if you have any questions, email me at naturesfriends at embarkmail.com. Thanks for watching.